And every time, I don't know, like I, you know why I am upset? The church is too weak. That's what I'm upset about. The church is too weak. For a church leader, look, I'm not judging. I will, I will kiss every church leader's feet. Please, don't get me wrong. But for a church leader to come and support this evil agenda, now that I cannot fathom. I'm still confused. I'm still confused. It would have been a lot easier and better for the church leaders at least to be quiet and say nothing. If you don't want to mention anything not so that you don't jabberize your position and your whatever, then go quiet. But for you to come and encourage your followers, encourage your faithful and say, go ahead, it's okay. Under what? Jesus is the protector. Excuse me? <laughs> really? Did you just find out that Jesus is the protector? You must be a genius. Jesus is the protector whether you say it or not, my dear friend. And you, do, you shouldn't even mention that because if you haven't found out that Jesus is the protector by now, forget about finding out because it's too late now. It was a plot and was an evil agenda, period. Because it came from evildoers. It came from people rejected the seal of God to be placed on their forehead. They followed Satan, period. What is been happening in the world is nothing short of evilness. Satanic. Wake up people and smell the roses. We are living in the end of times. Enough of everything is beautiful. Everything is beautiful when Jesus Christ is the crown of your head. Regardless what the world is going through. Don't worry about the world. But if you do not have Jesus Christ as your Lord, as your God, the world is nothing but chasing Satan and doing what Satan wants.